See what was the question given here? We have x is equals to e power cos 2x and what is y here? They have given y is nothing but uh, e power sin 2x. Then we need to find the dy by dx. Like we need to prove this, right? So let us see how to do. For proving this one, let us consider x. What is x? x is e power cos 2t. Is it okay? So now let us differentiate this function with respect to t. Is it okay? What I'll be getting here? This is nothing but dx by dt. What I'll be getting? Let me write the formula here. e power of x. What is the derivative of e power of x? That is e power of x alone. So I'll assume this whole thing is a capital X. Is it okay? So I can say that e power. The whole thing as it is. And we need to apply the whole thing derivative. So we will get dx by dt is nothing but e power cos 2a put 2t into. Uh, now let us move. What is the cos x derivative? We know that this is nothing but minus sin x. Is it okay? So I can apply. This is minus sin. What is this? So in place of x, we are having 2x. So again, try to assume it as a capital X. So this is sin 2t. Again, we need to apply the 2t derivative. So what I will be getting? I will be getting if you take dx by dt, what we should get? e power. This is cos 2t. And this minus will be outside into this is sine 2t and 2 into t derivative will be what 1 alone. So what I got finally I got dx by dt is nothing but minus 2 into this is sine 2t times e raised to the power cos 2t. Is it okay? So e raised to the power cos 2t is nothing but what? So they have given that that is nothing but x alone. So I will substitute that uh, x here. Is it okay? So what I will be getting here? This is nothing but dx by dt is equals to minus 2 this is a sine 2t into e power this i can take it as a x any doubts up to here yes so now let us solve this for further so if i solve this for further what i'll be getting okay take it uh, other than this we can stop up to here is it okay yeah so this is simply take it as a equation number one what is equation number two here let us take y what they have given they have given that y is nothing but e raised to the power sine 2t. Is it okay? Now let us differentiate this function with the respect to t. What we will be getting? We will get dy by dx is nothing but e power of x derivative will be e power of x alone as it is. And we need to apply sine 2t derivative which is nothing but e power this is sine 2t. What is sine derivative? Which is cos 2t. And we have to apply the 2t derivative. Is it okay? This is e power. This is sin 2t. And this is cos 2t. What is 2t derivative? That is 2. So finally, I will be getting dy by dx is nothing but what? This is 2 times cos 2t into e raised to the power sin 2t. Is it okay? e raised to the power sin 2t is nothing but y because it is given to us. So I will write it as dy by dx is nothing but what? 2 into cos 2t times this is y. Is it okay? So what should we do? We need to find dy by dx. Is it okay? So let us take this as equation number 2. So we need to find dy by dx. What is dy by dx? dy by dt by okay. I think I made a small mistake. We are differentiating with respect to t here. Unfortunately I have it an x. This is t. This is also t. This is also t. Okay. Yeah. So this is nothing but dx by dt. What is dy by dt? This is 2 times cos 2t times y by what is dx by dt? We have minus 2 times sin 2t times what we have? We have x here. So simply take x also. Is it okay? Yeah. If you cancel, we'll, we can cancel 2 too. So finally what we got? We got this is minus. This is cos 2t times okay y cos 2t by this is x times this is sin 2t. If you look into the problem, you don't have uh, t terms. Everything is in the form of x alone. Uh, now, what should we do? It's a simple bit of calculation we need to perform. Agree? So, now let us take it out. What is the question given to me? x. What is x? x is nothing but e raised to the power what? Cos 2t. So, if I want to bring something power to the front means, so simply apply log on both the sides. Log on both sides. If I apply what I will be getting here? log x agree and you have to remember one formula log x power of n what is the formula this is n log x 
So I'll be applying the same formula here. This means I can take actually cos 2t will be outside. This is log e. Is it okay? And you know, I think you should know log e base e will be what? This is always 1. So also I'll apply the same formula. Let me zoom out so that you can understand everything. Yes. So what I'll be getting here, this is nothing but log x is equals to what? Cos 2t into 1. So what I got? I can say that log x will be will be what? Cos 2t. Similarly, if I take it as what the other value, what is that? Y. What is y they have given to me? This is e power sin 2t. Uh, here also try to apply log on both the sides. Are you getting my point? Yes. If I apply log on both the sides, I'll be getting log y is equals to same formula. Sin 2t will become friend. This is log e. We know that log e is one of so we'll be getting log y is nothing but what? Sin 2t. This is the formula. I got it. Is it okay? Yes. So from this, what we'll be getting here, I can say that dy by dx is nothing but minus y times. What is cos 2t here? This is log x. I can take it out by x into what is sin 2t? This is log y. That also I can take it out. This is our final answer. This is what they are asking us to prove. Any doubts in this problem? I think so. You don't have any doubt, right? So if you feel like, man, uh, is there any other model? Yes. So let us take it as a, this is method one. Let me show you how to solve with the help of a method two. Is it okay? I think that is also easy. Whatever it feels like, you can take it. Is it okay? So what is this? We have x is equals to e raised to the power cos 2t we have. And we have y is equals to e raised to the power sin 2t. Is it okay? Hmm. So now what I will do here is, so simply let us apply log on both the sides. What I got here? I got from this log x is equal to what I got. Cos 2t I got. Uh, so let me write it down. This is cos 2t. Or if you feel like uh, some explanation if you want means. Uh, just a second. Mm. So if I apply log on both the sides. This is log of e raised to the power cos 2t. Okay. Yeah. So which is nothing but what log x is equals to. This is cos 2t log e will be 1. Is it okay? And if I apply log also here. Log y is nothing but what. This is log of e raised to the power sin 2t. Sin 2t will come friend log e. We know that log e is 1 now. So this is sin 2t log e. Log e I have taken it as a 1. Is it okay? Yes. So what I can do? Here cos cos is there. So take this as a equation 1. Take this as a equation number 2. What I will do? So try to make a square. Try to apply equation 1 square plus equation 2 square. Is it okay? You need to add them. Means left hand side log x the whole square plus this left hand side log y the whole square right side means what cos square 2t plus sin square 2t i can apply are you getting my point yes or uh, if you want one step i can add up here what is it squaring on both the sides means what log x the whole square is equals to this is cos square 2t is it okay here also log y the whole square is nothing but what this is sin square 2t or you can simply uh, add it. Is it okay? Both are same. Hmm. So now what I can do? We know that sin square theta plus cos square theta is one now. Very first identity. So I can write it as log x whole square. This is nothing but log y whole square is equals to 1. So now try to differentiate this function. What is this? x square derivative will be what? 2 into log x. Is it okay? And what is log x derivative? That is nothing but 1 by x. Is it okay? Yes plus this is also in the form of x square is it okay this is x square what is x square derivative 2x 2 into log y uh, and what is y log y derivative 1 by y into dy by dx i think you are aware of this which is equal to 0 if you feel like any doubts is there you just let me know we want dy by dx so 2 times log y by y into dy by dx try to send this term to the other side okay that is minus 2 times log x by x is it okay both the sides can i remove 2 2 yes we can so if i send the other term to the other side dy by dx is nothing but what here already we have log x by x if i send it it will become a reciprocal y by log y so finally what we got we got a dy by dx is nothing but minus y times log x by x times log y yes if you want to follow the first process simply go with that if you want to follow the second process uh, what I can say, yes, you can go with that. Nothing is, uh, what I can say, everything is correct, nothing is wrong. Is it okay? Yes. If you have any doubts, you just let me know. Thank you.